So I know today by Brian Hurley who got an incredible 12 points which helped Castlevin secure the Andy Scandal Cup for the second year in a row. Brian, congratulations, great victory. Yeah, unbelievable John. Um, I suppose, look, uh, we've kind of been aiming for this over the last three years, you know, it didn't work out in 2011, uh, 2012 was sweet and you know, today was even sweeter, like, you know, uh, we knew the hard work, we didn't want to fall short like we did in 2011 and, uh, you know, it came down to every pass, every block, every score, it was just, you know, everything was serious, you couldn't let anything slip and uh, luckily we came out on top in the end. Was there ever any thought, every, any um, during the game that you were actually um, you know, worried that you might be slipping away? Or yeah, like you know, the goal there is always killers, and like you know, we knew last year's goal and was crucial in the final. Like and uh, but we said we click away at the points. Like uh, you know, we put them over and over, and we said we click away, and usually goals win games. But look, the points did the job today, and we're, we're delighted because you know we usually do sneak a few goals, but uh, we didn't really get the chance today. And on a personal level, delighted with your own performance. Yeah, sure. Look, you know, the play of ball was unbelievable. Like I didn't have to run really too far. Was is pinging me into the chest and. Uh, you know, absolutely delighted from the boys and uh, you know, I suppose like the supply, as I said, the supply of ball from everyone, you know, it was just pinpoint into the chest and unreal stuff. Like, Three weeks time now you're going to Lions Gym playing the Kerry Champions in their own patch. Um yeah. we'll be looking forward to and hoping good, good Definitely like, like you know, it's just like Cock Kerry kind of battle again, like you know, you, you, you love them, look, we'll just take a few days off now, get the heads right again and uh, train hard again for that I suppose. Do you know they gave us a bit of a lesson last year but uh, hopefully we'll be up we'll be up a few things from the, from last year and really driving on. And second half again showed the character and determination of Castle Haven. Sean Deneen epitomised everything of it. Deneen was outstanding, I thought he took a lot of the pressure off the backs and uh, when we were winning ball like that, you know, about seven and a half feet up in the air he was cleaning ball, like it really frustrated Nemo and like they couldn't get the ball in. I thought that was a massive boost for us and you know the support kind of went when he did it. So I thought Deneen, Sean Deneen had an outstanding game, I thought. Looking okay, forward to unwinding for the next few days. Definitely, yeah, I think uh, we, we might go a bit mad this year because uh, we've three weeks of a break but uh, we'll we keep a few things quiet. Fair play. Congratulations. Well, well, that concludes our coverage of the uh, Senior Football Championship final in Parky Cueve, Castlevania and Marjorie Torres for the second year in a row.